So, uh, Tice, um, we've been talking for a while, haven't we, mate? And yep. um, you've been down a few times, and uh, it's lovely to finally have you here, mate, and actually have the lighting installed and uh, t to be up at half eleven at night calling you, yeah. asking <laughs> I for help. In bed already. <laughs> yeah. Because uh, because of the time difference. Yeah. So uh, the lighting it just blew everyone away at night, and um, it just really set the mood here, and it was brilliant, mate. So I'll let you introduce the uh, company. Yes. Well, thanks. First of all, thanks for having me. Also, we're really excited uh, uh, to be here. Um, let's start off to introduce you guys to the brand. Inlight is a Dutch brand founded in 1999. Um, I joined the company eight years ago. Um, and um, as uh, Simon was passionate about the planting, we are really passionate about lighting because lighting can give the outdoor space so much more. Um, I was telling Ollie, the other day that um, you as landscaping designers uh, and landscaping companies you sell uh, a garden but with uh, the right lighting you can get sell them actually two gardens so one for the daytime but also one for the nighttime and the outdoor life is getting more and more um, important for people and in this way uh, with the proper lighting plan you can extend the uh, yeah, time in your garden actually so um, the system works on 12 volts. Um, that's uh, a bit big difference uh, to uh, other uh, different lighting brands. And it's super easy to install. So all the landscaping companies in the Netherlands, in the Netherlands we're quite big. Uh, I think 80% of the landscaping companies in total work with our products. And uh, they are all installing them, uh, the, the lighting themselves. So uh, they don't need to have an electrician involved. Uh, you can run the cables yourself and then uh, later on uh, once the plantings are uh, uh, planted already and then you can uh, put in the lights. So I will uh, show you a little demonstration of the products. Um, every, everything you need is actually is a transformer. So uh, transformer got a plug just in the 230 volt socket and then we have a transformer with three entrances three lines and also three this uh also three different zones so let's say the front yard the backyard and the driveway or something like that um, you run the cables uh next to the lights where you want to have the lights and every light source has got as we call this a easy lock connector this is a basically a connector every fixture needs one um, you got little teeth in it if you can see it and uh, right right and left and you pinch it through the cable and it gets connection with the copper inside the cable and then you have connection screw the uh, hood on it and then uh, the lights will work so I will try to show you how it works so you have this great clip on it put it in turn the hood on it Then every fixture's got uh, a cable like this, and you put it in, and then you've got a connection. And that's super easy. It's um, if you have to install a light on 230 volts, uh, it probably take you 20 20 minutes per uh, per fixture. And uh, on our system, it's only take you like. 20 seconds or, sec seconds or, uh, or something like that. So it's super simple and in this way every landscaping company do, can do their own lighting and they won't have to be involved with an electrician and mm. in this way you can it's create great add on. magic. It's a great add-on isn't it for like, yeah. you know, if you haven't got experience in being an electrician, you know, you just easily install this yourself. So and you've uh, all got the uh, brochures and as you can see we have a quite big range of products so we have spotlights to illuminate the trees and then we have spike lights uh, integrated lights we've got path lights uh, path lights next to the driveway wall lights and as you can see we uh, try to um, develop our products in different kind of concepts so for instance here we've got the ace concept also in the super nice design of Karen uh, we've chosen the ace lights but Let's say there's a driveway over here, then you can put uh, a similar fixture next to the driveway. It has the same 
kind of look and feel, same uh, material, but also same light source. So the shape you will have on the wall, you will have the same shape of lighting on the driveway. And it's really nice and uh, it's a good story to tell your client, actually. So um, that's the side of the, for the landscape. It's really easy to install. You can do it all by yourself, but also as a garden designer, uh, we try to help those guys out. And as a garden designer, you need to know something about planting. You need to know something about paving. You need to know something about pergolas or whatever. But you cannot be specialist in everything. And we tend to be specialist in lighting. And we try to take that speciality from the uh, garden designer and help those guys making lighting plans. Mm -hmm. So what we do a lot is making lighting plans for gardens like this. We made a lighting plan for this garden as well. And um, if the client wants to move forward with it, we can make uh, uh, cable plannings and all that sort of stuff. So we're uh, yeah, very high in service and stuff. Oh yeah, I mean, <coughs> for us that was ideal really because then we could just give it to you know, we were so busy. We could have done it ourselves, but we were so busy. So we got an electrician that we knew just to run the cables. And he just came up, you know, had a plan to, to crack on with. And um, he unfortunately went on holiday and, they, and it was left down to us. So. <laughs> and me on the phone to you. I supplied the lights and I made a lighting plan. And it was, I, I walked in here this morning and I was amazed. I was really proud of you because oh, you did such <laughs> a great job. But I was quite proud of myself at uh, <laughs> half 11. <laughs> yeah, but... <laughs> it, it, it's uh, everyone can do it and if you have to do this with an electrician uh, also these these spaces uh, when I was a was I here for the last time like for well, one and a half months a month ago and the place looked entirely different so it was in such a short term and uh, if you need to have an electrician involved um, once he, the electrician uh, has time maybe uh, the, uh, the go away come yeah, back so um, that's a huge benefit for the landscaping company. So you can integrate the lighting scheme in your daily planning, really. So, mm. yeah. Well, and, and the design, I love like the sways you've got over here when the when the plants will grow up. Yeah. They, they will sway in the wind with the plants. Like. Yeah, like I said, we have products in a lot of different concepts. So if you have a, a, a product a, a garden with the organic shapes and stuff, then you have more uh, sh uh, products like with also round shapes, but if you have a more uh, tighter space, then you then we have uh, different uh, types of uh, products. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, we have uh, a lot of uh, I can uh, show them uh, later on, but uh, it's uh, yeah, mm -hmm. quite big a range. Yeah, and that's why you know we love Inlight is because it's another brand in our field in the outdoor lighting field that are just really passionate and you know continue to innovate in what they're doing so we actually went out to your showroom oh yeah and they've got a really cool like indoor dark room which is just all done out of outdoor lighting furniture you've actually got sun's furniture yeah, out there as well, yeah, yeah. and uh yeah good music yeah also <laughs> really big sonos installation but uh yeah we uh we uh, apart from other lighting brands uh, our main focus is outdoor lighting we do a hundred percent outdoor lighting and uh, from that it's 95 percent of gardens only gardens so uh, we develop our products just for the gardens and uh, um, if you look at other uh, lighting brands mostly the outdoor uh, part of the lighting brand is like 20 percent or something mostly inside but and then a little bit outside and uh, our main focus is gardening so um, if you look at our products, we have well thought of, uh, every product is r really well thought of because we are in, uh, in contact with a lot of landscaping companies and a lot of uh, garden designers and they, um, from their experience we develop our product so that worked really, really well. Yeah, and the brand, you know, I just love it, it just looks so slick. I love the brand in the, you know, the detail and the brochures you put together, it just looks yep. awesome, mate. Yeah, so it's, it's, it's really important for us because if I show you a fixture like this, uh, it's an integrated spotlight to illuminate a tree. Uh, looks quite nice, but you cannot tell what it does for you. So uh, for us, it, uh, it's, uh, it's very important to be inspirational and show them uh, the right uh, photography. And as you can see in the book and in the brochures, uh, we do uh, over 30 to 40 uh, gardens a year. Uh, we take pictures out of it uh, to show the people what, uh, what our lighting can bring for magic uh, to your garden mm. yeah yeah ex actually it's quite cool we uh 
a couple of years ago, we determined our uh, main goal for the company and we actually want to be the the number one lighting brand. We want to be the Coca-Cola of the outdoor lighting brand and that's that's our main goal and then, um, yeah like I said Simon was very passionate about his planting but we are super passionate about lighting because yeah lighting uh, you can extend your garden life so much more so uh, yeah. Mm, brilliant mate. Awesome. Any questions maybe? Yes. Hi. Uh, Hi. I, um, I'm based in Brighton, which is by the sea. Yes. And um, a lot of the fittings corrode like hell. Yeah. Do you have? Yeah, do any of your fittings would they stand up to the, yeah, it's the conditions uh, of salt? And it's a good question. Uh, I get the question a lot. Uh, Netherlands is also based uh, <coughs> at the sea. So um, uh, because of the experience we have, we had some products uh, in, uh, in the past who corroded very easily. So uh, we produced, uh, uh, for instance, this is a fixture, it's powder coated. It's um, FCBV coating and that's really high intensity quality. So um, if this uh, doesn't corrode, you can actually throw it in the sea and it doesn't corrode. And also this is powder coated, but for instance, um, these fixtures are, um, uh, this is anodized, ano, anodized aluminum, and anodized aluminum was also being used in the uh, marines, and how do you say that, uh, yeah, okay. in the ships, and, mm. and uh, that sort of stuff. So it's, it's well thought of, and uh, uh, all the products are uh, resistant for the, for the salty environment. They are, okay, yeah. great. Yeah. Thank you. Just want to say, Ollie sent us a photo after weeks of building our garden, yeah. <laughs> and getting a picture from him. You know, a couple of weeks before it all opened with the lights on yeah. in one evening was just incredible. Ah. Just to see it come to life, and as you said, obviously garden spaces as we're in now are becoming an add-on of people's interior living yeah. spaces, yeah. and it's that kind of transition between, as you said, using using it as much as you can. Um, just on a on a kind of user point, is what length is there a certain length that each each run of yeah. cable is kind of maximized to? Is there just like a maximum yeah. reach? Yeah, because of the low voltage, there are some restrictions. Um, we have two types of cable. In this case, we have the thicker cable inside the transformer, and you can run straight lines of 80 meters. So three times 80 meters, so 80 meters that way, 80 meters that way, and 80 meters that way. That's already a quite big range. Yeah, yeah. This transformer is called a Smart Hub 150. We also have a Smart Hub 300, and that's the, the number stands for how many fixtures you can add on the transformer. Mm -hmm. But I was telling you about the low voltage. Uh, we recently introduced a new transformer, it's called the Smart Hub 300. Uh, same look and feel as this, but has more uh, capacity but uh, the power is a little bit more so we can run long um, run longer lines so instead of 80 meters it's 160 meters yeah so uh, you can for the really really big gardens we also have a solution and then we have the smart of 300 so you can run 160 line straight line that's amazing quite long. yeah yeah that's yeah. incredible yeah excellent good question <laughs> cheers just don't uh, bury the cable like we did, Jacob. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I heard the story. It was good. <laughs> <laughs> Under the trees as well, and the, and the plants. Yeah, well. it's, nightmare. I but know it's 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 uh it's something else because in I I we started in in the UK a couple of years ago, and uh, I found out that landscaping companies aren't used to uh, working with lights, so it has to be mindset a little bit. But, well, but so. It's good to uh, to see how easy it is. So you, uh, and, and eventually you will get confident. And yeah. in, in the Netherlands, there are landscaping companies who, uh, uh, yeah, put in inlight in every every garden. So it's uh, eventually yeah. we'll get confident. And yeah, well, that was the good thing about it is because instead of you know exposing all the cable, we just expose a little bit at the lowest point and just use another connector and just run another bit of cable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, I'm not digging that whole bed out just to yeah, find yeah, yeah, the cable. That's, that's, yeah. At 11 o'clock at night. So soon. <laughs> yeah. You use holding the phone. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we, we put them uh, in Paul Wood's garden. We actually set two of those in the decking. Oh, yeah. 
Yeah, just behind the, uh, yeah, the plants. Yeah, and, uh, and uh, we uh, Inlight is uh, is a Dutch brand, but we do quite a big business already in in Europe. So Germany, Scandinavia, uh, try to do something more in the UK now. But we are also quite big in the US and Canada, and the decking market in US and Canada is really really big. So in US and Canada. Uh, we uh, mostly sell recessed lights in in the decking so mm. yeah and it's all controlled from the app yeah isn't it yeah 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 i, I can uh talk until uh 11 o'clock uh, tonight but uh yeah it's uh, it's all run by our own inlight app so you can personalize the lighting and like i said um the every uh, transformer has three lines so you can switch them separately and in this way you can also um uh, make uh, your lighting frame durable so uh, don't need to be the lights uh, on when you're uh, asleep but uh, um, you can personalize it and say okay i uh, will go to bed at 11 o'clock uh, and in the weekly days and in the weekends uh, the lights go off at uh, two o'clock at night and uh, uh, you can have a morning routine so the lights will go on uh, once you're awake and in this way you can um, work uh, with your uh, Fixtures very durable, and uh, yeah, then they uh, will go on. And what's in the pipeline, Ty? So you got you got new designs, new thing, new products. Yeah, out. there. Uh, every year we come up with uh, new uh, products, but uh, at the time it's um, the transformer is called a smart hub, and that's because um, you can also install smart lights on it. We have several smart lights. I uh, showed you just the smart scope tone. It's a, a, a spike light in which you have a warm white uh, LED, but also uh, RGB LED, so you can switch the lights. If you have a party or something, you can uh, uh, personalize the lighting, uh, color it uh, the way you want, and also dim it. And uh, for instance, here in the, under the bar, we have an LED strip, and it's also dimmable, so you can uh, dim it uh, how you want it. And uh, these are things that we want to develop more and more and more. So uh, all the fixes that we are introducing uh, probably will be, um, yeah, smart, smart wise. Yeah. And is it, it's all designed in Holland, isn't it? And then it's yeah. manufactured abroad. Yeah, it's uh, we have our own research and development department of uh, five people, who constantly thinking about how to get it better uh, and new new fixtures and stuff. And uh, all our products are assembled in uh, Taiwan. So a lot of uh, products. Uh, uh, the, material, the, the aluminum comes from uh, uh, Taiwan, for instance, but the chips come from the Netherlands and uh, there are all parts coming out of the world and uh, uh, the end result will be made in uh, Taiwan. Oh, so it's all assembled out in Taiwan? Yeah, it's all assembled there. Yep. Brilliant. As a company there which produces uh, our products for mm. us. Amazing. Thank you. Okay, thank you.